live day. Okay, here's the deal. Your calendar's full. You're looking down June and you are thinking, am I ever gonna come up for air? I need some looks for all of those, what I would call kind of in-betweener moments. It's not the most dressy event you have on your calendar, but it's not the most casual. So here's what I'm thinking about. I'm thinking about graduations, thinking about graduation open houses, I'm thinking about showers and thinking about maybe even some fun bachelorettes if you're lucky. That could be kind of fun. I am also thinking about high school and college reunions. They are happening this summer and you just need some great chic looks to put together to wear. I gotcha. We got it solved for you. All the options, including thinking about when you are sitting and baking under the sun at some of those events, you need something cool and comfy. Here we go. Let's start with this dress. How fun is this guy? Now, what I think this dress does, it checks all the boxes, right? It is more of a shift silhouette, so translation. It's not clinging to you. It's not super hot. It's really, really comfy. Little bit of shoulder coverage on this one because of that ruffle, which I think is so fun. Yes, it has pockets for your phone, so you can take a million pictures of wherever you are. Above the knee length, so an easy, easy one to wear. And I love this V-neck because you know it is the most universally flattering neckline out there. Did I mention that it's eyelid? Which I think is really fun and unexpected for black instead of white. It makes it a little bit edgier, not so sweet. Runs true to size, really, really comfortable on this guy. Just got it in, and I know this is gonna be one of those fly out the door situations. Couple other dresses and kind of pieces that I think fall into this category. First and foremost, can we talk about this amazing romper from Rivet Utility? Okay, truth be told, I just came back from an amazing weekend in Cabo celebrating my dear, dear sister-in-law who, let's be honest, I don't know why I call her my sister-in-law because she really is truly more like my sister. I absolutely adore her and we were also with a really good mutual friend of ours, Shannon, you might know her from House of Shan. She was wearing this rivet utility romper and we were all just drooling over how fabulous it looked. Here's what's fun about it, what we kept talking about it. It's dressed up, but still kind of casual. It's really flattering, but doesn't feel like you're trying too hard. It's kind of relaxed, but also feels really chic. And of course, because it's rivet utility, it is made to the detail. So you know Rivet Utility, this is all made in LA, in LA factories, by LA artisans and craftspeople. Started out of a garage, can you believe it or not? In 2020, this is the brainchild of Dawn. We absolutely love her and we love what she's created. So here's the deal with this romper, why we love it. Number one, zip front. So really easy in and out and you can kind of control how sexy or not sexy you want to go. Great color detail, you can pop this a little bit. Short sleeves, so that's nice if you want a little bit more coverage. Self belt, which you could also swap out if you wanted to with a great little woven belt and a short. So an easy one to wear. I find that these Rivet Utility jumpers run two to size. So I did not need to size down in this one. This is more of a linen fabrication. It doesn't wrinkle like crazy. It's meant to look a little bit lived in, so don't worry about it being perfect. This is a fantastic investment piece. So fun to wear, and that sprucey green color is so yummy. Another really versatile option in the kind of that one piece category is this great jumpsuit. Now, you might recognize this. This was featured in our last catalog, and we finally got it in. We've been waiting on pins and needles for this one to arrive. This is a familiar jumpsuit for you. We've actually had this silhouette before. Here's why we love it all smock details in the back adjustable cami strap and a beautiful wide leg. Now this looks just as chic paired with a pair of Birkenstocks as it does with a great little wedge. As an example, I think this Dolce Vita would be so darn cute with this. It's comfy, it's easy, it packs like a dream. So a really fun one just to throw into your bag if you're heading out of town. I just love this guy because it really looks good on so many different body types. 
All right. I can't pop this on because I'm wearing a dress and, you know, we're trying to keep this rated G. But if you want to see it on, check out my stories on Saturday. I'm going to be wearing it there. You're just going to have to take my word for it today. This dress is a dream. Why I love it. It's from BB Dakota. It's got this great V neckline, a little bit of a covered shoulder. So just a touch of a sleeve, which is so nice. Not too deep of an armhole. So it really does kind of cover up your bra. It's one of my biggest beefs about dresses when they cut so low and you're like, well, I mean, what, what am I supposed to do here? My bra is hanging out and I feel kind of slappy. Really flattering. What makes this dress so terrific is this line under your bust. It is figure flattering. It is so shaping and you get to wear your normal bra with it. Tiered dress on this one. So it is a maxi length. I wore this with a pair of heels in my stories. I also wanted to try it with a pair of flats. I totally can get away with it. So even me, not quite five foot four, I can wear this without a draping on the ground. And this yummy orange color with this e print is to die for. So love this guy for maybe a more casual event. You've got it on the calendar. If you want to wear a dress, but you don't want to feel too dressed up, this guy is pretty versatile. So there's lots of ways to wear it. But I think the print and the neckline in this is really what makes it. Okay. But what if you have something that you need to be like show stopping for? We're talking about showing up. This is the big wedding. This is the big event. You need to turn that dial all the way to 11 and show your very best self. Here's the dress for you. First of all, let's talk about the color. This yummy, yummy cornflower blue. This is from Velvet. What's great about this dress is that it is a cotton blend. So really light and airy. Feels super fun for warm weather days. Elastic banding here on that one shoulder and an adjustable tie. So you can really bring this up or down as much as you want. More of an A-line shape on this one, which I also love that because it just moves with you. This guy does have pockets. And it's got some tiering. So answers to that tiered dress trend. Really feels fun and breezy. I love the one shoulder because it's a little sexy, but the body's not super fitted. So it doesn't feel like you're trying too hard. Stunning, stunning option. This is what I'm grabbing when I know that I've got something really special coming up and I want to just blow the doors off and feel like my very best self. Okay. I also know though that there are some of those more casual events where you need a dress, but you don't want to be too dressed up. You want to feel put together. You want to feel chic. Ugh, but you also don't want to try too hard and you want that dress to work hard for you. So maybe you're going to wear it to an event, but you also want to be able to wear it to a bunch of other things that are maybe happening this summer. So I'm going to start from the top because you know this dress. We love this dress. So this guy, I always goof the two names of it. This is the everywhere dress and it earned its name for a reason. This dress goes everywhere. Flattering, fun. You might remember we had this in a black and white stripe. We had it in a green and white kind of palm print. And now we have it in this yummy, yummy oceanic blue. So, so beautiful. So tiered. But the tiering is the secret sauce here. It's not hitting you at the bust line. It's hitting you below the bust line. It has pockets, it's short and breezy, flirty and fun. It looks fabulous with a denim jacket over it. Scratch it up a little bit, pop on a utility jacket instead. Match collar, runs true to size, so an easy one to pop on. This one is flying, flying, flying. So if you haven't snagged this new color, get it now because you will miss it if you don't. Another really fun, what I kind of call a blank slate dress, is this fun knit dress from Nation. Now black dresses, ooh, they're always so hard to show on live, but I want you to see the detail on this one. Great little just tank body, two tiers here. So really more of, I'd say like more of a midi length. This is not a maxi, but what's great about a dress like this is that this is one that you can kind of lean into for just about anything. Baseball game, Burks, hat, check. Dinner out with girlfriends, wedge, fun earring, check. Date night with the hubs, mm. like maybe a fun little like bear wrap sandal and a great little necklace, check. 
vacation check it does all the things if you've got a long day where you've got a bunch of graduation parties back to back this would be a fun one to wear because it's just so easy and also it's black so it's spill proof so one of my favorites here from nation it's a really nice lightweight knit so it doesn't show wrinkles and again in black makes it super super easy to wear i even love that that just subtle seaming detail in the back just shows great quality on this one one of my absolute faves and then last but not least in the dress category i am calling for all of you curve ladies out there this is the dress for you what's so fun about this is that it hugs in all the right places skims in all the right places and is so darn comfy so you've got all this great ruching all down both sides so this is one of those dresses you can kind of wiggle into right you move that ruching where you need it maybe you want a little bit more around your tummy maybe you want a little bit less on your thighs or vice versa it really does kind of shift however you want it to shift and because that ruching literally starts under the arm and goes all the way to the bottom of the dress lots of options there v-neck so you've got a nice open neckline and you've got a really fun complement on the sleeve here with a little bit more volume now it's a knit so it's not going to be super structured but it's surprising how much lift you get in the sleeve from all of this beautiful kind of tucking detail it really balances out the dress it balances out that more fitted silhouette gives you some nice shape on top and again a sleeve so normal bra with this guy throw this guy down dress it up dress it down and i also think this kind of wash down red is a really fun easy color that doesn't feel too bright but is a nice alternative to like your black or your navy okay we covered all the one piece situation but what if you just want a great top and a jean when i think about especially graduation parties and showers and open houses I'm always thinking like what's the easiest thing to wear and I look around the room and I always see some elegant chic put together woman who's got on a great pair of white denim and a statement top it's an easy go-to right it looks put together it feels high summer but you don't have to think too hard about it so first step is finding the best pair of white denim for your body I've got a couple really fun ones let's see where should we start I'm going to start with this great pair from Edwin. I'm actually wearing a different pair when I came into the studio this morning. And speaking of which, do you guys love this new space? Isn't it fun? I feel like I'm like pretending I live in a New York loft for the morning. It's so great. Okay, so this is the Marley ankle. Now, what's really fun about this jean from Edwin, it's a wider leg, so more of a straight, but wider. So I like this because especially if you're a tucker, it's really flattering. I find Edwin, even when they call a jean a high rise, I find that it's a little bit lower than some of our other brands. I like that because if you have a shorter torso or if you just don't like things sitting quite so high, this is a great jean for you. We also know that Edwin is one of the most sustainable denim brands out there. So always proud to carry this. This is a great white jean and I wanna make sure they call it they call it eggshell, so it's just a slightly softer, it's not a bright, bright white. So really, really great one. This is also really good for those of you out there who are more petite. It's a nice ankle length. Okay, now, if you love the idea of doing something that's more of a flare, but you've got some long legs, or you are committing to wearing more of a wedge or a heel, I've got a couple really fun flares for you. We're going to start with the page. This is the Laurel Canyon. This has been in their line for years for a darn good reason. This is a really flattering flare. 32 inch inseam, raw hem. So an easy one to alter at home with your scissors. Remember, if you need tips and tricks on how to cut your own denim, we've got a video for that. Check it out at everyweave.com on every TV. You can see how we do it. Really easy. I've always been afraid to do it, but after I watched the video, it's like, okay, I can do it. I can do this. Like, this is doable. Got a little tutorial, showed you how to do it, really fun. Okay, so Laurel Canyon, this is a high rise. It's more of a boot. So not a super, super strong flare. This is one of Paige's best selling silhouettes for good reason. Their white denim is really, really a soft hand. Feels very cottony. I do go up a size in this one. It has a ton of stretch, but in white, I want to go up a size. All right. Next step, we're going from like 
Smallest flare to largest flare. Okay, this is the Good American. I want to give you the right name of this. This is the Good Classic. They call it a boot. I'm going to say this is really cross between a boot and a flare. It's definitely wider than the page. Also, I'd say um, a slightly like thicker and more sturdy fabrication from Good American, which makes sense to me. They're always thinking about how to really structure denim to hold you in and flatter the body. I love the details in the back of this. This yoke seaming as well as the pocket size, which is hard to find in a great pair of white denim, is crazy, crazy flattering. This is also a high rise. Again, a little bit more structure than the page, but still has a tremendous amount of stretch. And then last but not least, let's talk about this Hudson Holly. Charla, if you don't watch Charla, I'm calling out her name right now because this is for all of you long-legged mamas. This is a true flare. It is long, long, long. So I really recommend this for someone who is a little bit taller. So looking at you five, four and under, this is gonna be a trickier jean for you to wear unless you have really long legs for your height because that flare truly is not just a boot cut, it's a full on flare. So if you needed to hem this a couple inches, you're gonna lose a lot of that kick. Ooh, bummer. So I would go back to your page or to your Good American, lean into that if you're more petite. If you're blessed with long legs, I say go for this one because no one does it better than a tall gal in these jeans. Okay. So that's your four white denim ideas. Everything from that great little wide leg all the way to that true, true flare from Hudson. Now, what are we pairing back to it? Well, I've got a couple of great options for you. We can go print or we can go solid. I'm gonna go first with solid and are you sensing the theme? This is an eyelet moment we're having here in my dress, in my blouse, and in my tank. Yes, you can do white on white. I think it's so, so chic. This is where you bring in your neutral accessories. So maybe you're wearing like a great little wrap sandal and your white blouse and your white jeans. This would be really fun back to that Edwin wide legs. I think it's kind of a nice proportion balance there. This is from Evereve. This is the Callista eyelet button down. Couple things about this guy, not lined. So you have options here. You can either wear a simple cami underneath this guy Oh, lies, it is lined, sorry. Cami built in underneath this guy. It is more of a stretchy cotton hand, so really, really comfy to wear. Just wear your nude bra underneath this. It'll line right up with that cami strap. And I love when designers are thinking that cami strap actually snaps in, so you're not gonna like have it sliding off your shoulder. Really beautiful blouse here with that open neckline and the covered buttons, the quality is impeccable. Now, if you wanna go a little bit more contrast, brand new blouse from Evereve. I love this in the black, so, so pretty. Also a little bit more sleeve coverage. So, ooh, I'm flaring, there, let's see, move in, there we go. Okay, so, a little bit more sleeve coverage on this guy. This is more of a relaxed shoulder. I like this one, same detail here, covered placket on this. You'll notice a little bit shorter of a body. Now, you've got options here. You can just leave it out with your white jean, which I think would be so chic, or you can just do a little half tuck. The beauty of this is you don't have to think too hard about it. It's really flattering and really lovely. In this eyelet moment, again, you can see how you can wear it without it getting too sweet. It can still feel really strong and put together. A fun option for that kind of white denim combination. All right, and last but not least, let's talk about print. Now this is, I think, more on the fun side of your white denim pairing. If you are doing a backyard barbecue, I'm thinking about kind of lawn games and just like hanging out. Two really cute options. The first, absolutely love this. This is from Ronan Ryan. This beautiful watercolor ecot, soft, soft colors here. Really pretty. Now you'll notice this is grounded in creams but it looks really fantastic back to white. So ruffle detail around the neck as well as on the arm. This is a true woven silhouette, so I think it feels a little more elevated and dressed up. A really fun one, and again, I love this with a good neutral shoe. So imagine this little wedge and your white denim. I mean, done, it kind of pulls it all together. It feels really put together. And then last but not least, did I save the best for last or what? 
Cleo Bella, this blouse, so stunning. You know it from the dress. We sold that dress like crazy. Here is in a stunning, stunning blouse version. Cotton poplin, really light and airy. Great sleeve, you know Cleo Bella, they're always gonna build in all the bells and whistles, so this fun tassel. Beautiful shell buttons on this one. Really fun back to white. Now, I think this also looks terrific with like a little blue cutoff, but there's something about pairing this with a white jean that just makes that print sing. So fun, so easy. Love, love, love this one as well. Okay, did I give you some ideas? Is the calendar full? Are you thinking about what you're gonna wear? Did we figure it out for you? I hope so. Hope this gave you some great ideas on how to get dressed this month for all the things that are on your calendar. If you have any questions, of course, don't hesitate to reach out and make sure you're tuning in. We've got so many great ideas popping with all of our style crew. We can't wait to share with all of you. Thanks so much, everyone, and we will see you soon.